the whole Kabir Singh album also I would say that I had already done five songs for the album before I was replaced. ठीक है सूरज डुबाई की यार हो गए life set बहुत बहुत पापड़ हमने भी बेले. You saw success after a long period of struggle. Did it go to your head? No, it never did. I think. But why? How? What was the one factor that kept you grounded? Mummy, <laughs> our <laughs> mother. Like people say that parents keep us grounded, my mother keeps both of us underground. Anyway, अभी भी she will shout and say, "Utho, plate रखो." There is no easy way out for us, in spite even if it looks like the Maliks and the clan and <laughs> like you know all of that nepotism. ये वो इनका आसानी से मिल गया. ऐसी चीजें चलती है लोग सोचते हैं बट आई नेवर हैड माय ओन कंप्यूटर आल्सो और ऑन सीपीयू आई कुडंट अफोर्ड अ लैपटॉप टू बी ऑनेस्ट कि डर लगता है नेक्स्ट क्या करें या नेक्स्ट को लिव अप कैसे करें ये लिव अप का तो प्रॉब्लम होने वाला है सबको व्हेन यू डू गुड वर्क इफ यू डू सॉन्ग्स लाइक रोके ना रोके कौन तुझे मैं रहू बोल दो ना जरा आई डोंट नो व्हाट ऑल इज हैपेंड जब तक देन एक्सपेक्टेशंस लोगों के भी बढ़ते हैं एंड यू आल्सो गेट अ लिटिल यू नो स्ट्रेस्ड कि यू नो नाउ व्हाट Well, I don't know if there is an apt introduction to introduce somebody who is an all-rounder when it comes to music. But Amal, if I have to start with you for the first ever being an all-rounder, is it a stressful situation to be in? Because they say jack of all trades and master of none. Do you agree or not? I'm a master of hearts. I don't know about <laughs> anything else. I'm not a jack anywhere, and I think I'm the king of hearts. I think young kids and even people who are my parents age and <clears throat> even before and even uh, elder to them all of them love my music it's unbelievable to see ki 12 years old bhi mere fan hai and there are 60 year old 70 year olds also who love my music so i think i'm a master of hearts so you can say that safely <laughs> that's the sweetest but mal if i have to ask you because uh, not much has been there when it, i i tried to look towards your journey yeah. what was your first twist with music what was the first time like of course you come from the family yeah. of music sardar malik sahab then anu malik your father dabu malik but what was your uh, thing that mujhe music mein jana hai kahan se aaya i think wo realization to around 16 mein hui but the first twist with music was at the age of 8 when one of my grandfather's friends got me that casio oh and i used to be a kid playing with batman he man and having a good time but my mom saw me ki you know ye sab toys chhod ke is instrument se itna obsessed hai so somewhere my mother was very responsible she saw that this kid is really interested is breaking this instrument but he's not leaving it wo besura ho gaya itna maine baja di usko so she enrolled me in music classes and she would really work hard and take me to you know very far off music classes in a rickshaw with uh, school books also saath saath me to study the same drill she did with arman also so i think for both of us in spite of being from musical family i think the lady of the house uh, always wanted the kids to also you know study but pursue the father's dreams wow and she realized that my dad always wanted uh, one of us to be at least a film composer and i turned out to be the right right <laughs> choice towards that so you know the journey started at 8 and at 16 i uh, called my dad i was playing the piano i said maine kuch banaya hai and i played him a composition and that's where you know it was very important for me to know what my father thinks ki main kar sakta hu ki nahi and he said you know you have what it takes and he told me one very good thing i would say he's my best friend you know my parents uh, both of our parents they like the fantastic four this family and now five with handsome our little of pet course. but both the parents have been really friendly very open with their kids and even when there are hard times for my father in his struggle his career everything he told me one thing is like in our family there have been great composers but none of them have taken their education to the next level and learned music production learn how to write music or at least read a little bit of music so his dream was ki is maidan mein utarna hai to please sab seekh ke aana kyunki when people used to ask him he wouldn't know what a certain scale or chord and things because they are naturally gifted musicians mm. making music in the air my grandfather was trained in hindustani but our no uncle and dad are not uh, you know my uncle plays the harmonium but they are not formally trained in it okay. and There is no easy way out for us. In spite, even if it looks like the Maliks and the clan and <laughs> like you know all of that nepotism, ये वो इनका आसानी से मिल गया. ऐसी चीजें चलती हैं लोग सोचते हैं. 
but uh, we were not the super successful composer sons my father saw decent success did 60 70 films was never nominated never considered you know part of this industry till i arrived so there were things there were uh, dreams to complete and everything that you see is happening for me now is only dabu malik and jyoti malik dreams my journey is just begun so i think my dream to do film music was only because it was my father's dream and when i started uh, my career that was the only way today the independent music is the space where you can just put your song so the 16 year old amal malik dream today the 32 year old amal malik is completing baki sab is for my parents so that's that's about it this family has had a legacy but it was really difficult for this young kid at 23 when i did jai ho and people expected a lot such a big star gave me a break like salman khan and my music didn't work from that film at all maybe it was too early for india to understand edm and then it worked with suraj duba the same idea but it was difficult they would compare me to annu malik dabu malik and saying not a chip of the old block and it was very difficult for me and then i had to think ki annu and dabu ki jagah a new bante mm-hmm. you know the new malik is amal malik and that's all it is i think i had to train myself i worked with the right composers as an assistant amar mohile salim suleman uh, sandeep chota sabse kuch na kuch seekh ke meri musicality bani and it was in my genes maybe so it was both but my father was very careful he was like i don't want any musician in the world to be able to ask you a question and you don't have an answer so when i performed with the melbourne symphony and did something with the macedonia orchestra for sinas biopic and all i can converse with world musicians so my dad's dream is almost there with that also the 16 year old the composition you made your father here what was that is it out in space or is it still no, with you no still with me it's not come out yet all of that see the, the film route made me make music what was needed for films you know and luckily i think uh, you know i don't even think commercially i say i make music for my own heart and somewhere i think everyone has a heart like this it's people say if you feel the same way in love heartbreak friendships i think i have made music on every kind of relationship and genre in the last 8 years so dad ne jo tunes ko you know he had heard those i never went and pitched i never work like that on a bank i always hear a situation try to make or agar kuch purana yaad aata and it, i feel like shit man i've made something like this it can go then i remove something from my collection otherwise those are my own private personal ah. songs i'm little possessive about things uh, at least my music ki even when a song releases i feel ki abhi mera nahi ab sabka ho gaya ab mere ko bura lag raha so i'm not hearing it so that's me uncomplicated and complicated in a musical way so that's how the education towards the music at trinity school of yes, music yes, uh, came into the fore yes. so obviously i couldn't uh, afford to go to london or anywhere i've still not been to the uk but my music has you know so these things make me realize that my dad was very key in doing this he at 16 he told me ki come like a warrior don't come as a nihatta don't come like no people can question you don't have answers so i did trinity college of london then learned a little bit of jazz and pop and rock piano playing also hindustani classical i never formally trained in but i was i would say lucky that uh, till the age of 15 i got to spend time with sardar malik my grandfather Ji. and my dadi's elder brother hasrat jaipuri so lyrics and composition ke do diggaj mere life mein the and i was the only grandkid who was staying with the grandparents oh. you know you know arman me mom dad this family was staying with the grandparents yeah. till my 10th grade baki yeah. everyone had their own houses not being able to uh, get that education you know would be a problem i think i was blessed ki i was born while these people were alive and two great people prolific writer prolific composer from the 60s 70s so mujme udhar se leke ab tak ka music hai 90s i'm born in but the 60s 70s like mai rahu ya na rahu and all remind a lot of people that it's that era so i would say i just i'm a fan of that kind of music and i just add the sound of today to it that's all that's very humble way to put but man when um, a 10th grade student decides that i want to be a music assistant on films and work with you know yeah. composers to learn yeah. the craft um how was it as a decision wise for you because as you said you were clear in your head and your father was making sure it's clear in your head ki yeah. this is not going to come easy to you yeah. but to go this raw 
what is 10 15 16 years and then yeah, start my first film was sarkar with amar mohile as a background score assistant 2005 and that's where i saw how you know the best background score of our country that is still you know considered all the govinda go oh yeah that's that. like an epic so just being around in that room and seeing that man and uh, make such music with such a great director mera first training hi bahut acha hua but i always wanted to run away. i was like you know it was like ye padhao ke baad 12th ka padhao mummy was the one because she comes from the lawyer uh, science and doctor background and everyone so education is a must for her so i said dekho 10th ho gaya 2 saal hai i want to get out you know then i'll come back in 12th and day or wings and i'll study again so in those two years i just went out to every composer out me pritham da out me try my best you know and not ki phone mila hai kuch this is the time when there's no google properly set up there is no youtube to put your demos it's just beginning and uh, there are cds which We are, are the non-existent. same age so i know this yeah. exactly same it is non existent now to have a music cd or anything and i used to make my demos and go literally gate to gate door to door like a salesman in a way to just see that i was i used to just take my keyboard and to play something and say i can do this and i didn't have an idea ki wo music laptop pe banta hai till i went out you know production and all these things my father had seen it because he had people producing along with him but i never had my own computer also or a cpu i couldn't afford a laptop to be honest and my very uh, close childhood friend uh, his name is krish he was someone he literally at that time he was a gamer mm. so uske paas bahut extra ram pada hota tha so he used to remove all the ram and he used to give me and said we'll make a machine for you and so we made a computer i used to take um which car is this some santro zing thing mere paas and i used to put that on one display screen and lan cable hota tha wifi nahi tha yes wo leke i used to go to famous star deo and my first uh, thing was that i'll try ads i'll try anything because for me in the year 2006 uh, my grandfather was he had uh, alzheimer's i think parkinson's something of a brain disease and he was passing away my father was at almost the end of his career because he had 10 12 films in hand almost 20 maybe and he said amal i cannot make music anymore my music is dying he took a bed next to his father and i think is one of the most amazing sons there ever could be he shifted to the icu and he stayed with my grandfather you know till the end of his life and that man told me like i cannot make music anymore i hope you maine socha tha 10th khatam hua college jayenge assist karenge sab ho jayega you know just bang chill have a normal college life but i'm glad that he told me this he said i'm i'm done so my grandpa was uh, in his last stages in 2006 and my father for my father his father was music just how for me my father like i don't know what i will ever do if you know my father is no yeah. more i hope he has a long life god bless that would and dabu malik is someone who's living a teenage life now you know he's living all his dreams and he behaves every gadget comes out anything happens he's enjoying life what he couldn't do as a young man and, you know he's too many responsibilities i was born when he was 26 my mom was 21 oh. so they were babies man like i'm 30 now and i'm like kids <laughs> as i can't handle a girl <laughs> a relationship as the time how has he done it but at that age when my grandpa was passing away he said i am shifting to the hospital he stayed with him till his last breath and he said may films jaye to jaye i cannot help it and us time pe aisa hi tha that out of sight out of mind films chali gaye dusre composers ko and he was he had zero and all he told me was that he he knew what works always you know he's like my kind of music is you know that whole indian space has changed there are new kids like pritam vishal shekhar and salim suleman who done kal das and dhoom he's like listen to that music that is what is going to f- create the future sound So he was very right in providing me who to follow who also. To follow. But it was very difficult being a Malik. You know, I used to not tell my surname because जहाँ मैं surname बोलता था वो composers काम नहीं देते थे. Because I'm from a musical family, there was some kind of insecurity. You know कि शायद अपने family में tune सुना देगा हमारी. ये इस industry में है. And अब नहीं है. अब we are really many cool people and people also have evolved. But there was no way to get a job anywhere. and i used to take my keyboard run behind i used to find out car numbers of composers and their cars and be like i think they stay here i'll wait down near the watchman's cabin i've done it all and i've no shame in admitting it mere liye wohi zaruri tha to that struggle nahi hota to main aur us age pe nahi pata chalta to i would have started now 
because in my head and according to this industry you can only become a composer at 30 plus when you lived and log bolte hai tumne ji hai kya experience kya hard break and so main jahan hu is age pe i think people like my father or salim sir and reeta manol have debuted at 32 33 i'm already amal malik which is unbelievable kyunki mere ko jab jai ho bhi mili thi i was i told salman sir i said you can give beats by amal malik he said aisa koi credit nahi hai He's like music composer. I said, no, no, it's too heavy a title. So I was only preparing and hoping that you know I had to run my house. And my dad had loans. There was hospital bills by my for my grandfather. There were too many things that this family needed to come out of. So this young kid went out, did uh, even background score as an assistant to Raju Singh. Did uh, Mile Jab Ham Tum, Sanjeevni. I was doing character themes that. for that. Doing uh, the lyric, you know the lyric writer Vayu Shrivastha. I've heard of yes, him. Yes, so he was promo producer at Sub TV. I was promo music director. Oh, so there used to be a song of Mithun or Jeet Ganguly, and beach me ten second ka add hota tha that I used to make music for. Wow. So I we have I've done it all, you know, just to come here, and ye kisi ko nahi pata tha ki yani aisa journey hai mera, and good through you people are getting to see that you know it's not. सूरज डुबाई की और हो गए लाइफ सेट बहुत बहुत पापड़ हमने भी बेले एंड माय यंगर ब्रदर आल्सो हैव टू गिव इट टू हिम हियर बिकॉज एट द एज ऑफ इलेवन आफ्टर यू नो ही वाज रेलिगेट फ्रॉम सारे गा मापा एंड ड्यू टू वेरी वियर्ड रीजन सेइंग कि यू बिलोंग फ्रॉम अ वेरी सक्सेसफुल फैमिली सो तुम्हें तो मौका मिल जाएगा आई थिंक आई हैव टू मेक दिस क्लियर थ्रू दिस इंटरव्यू दैट एवरी सॉन्ग इवन द आउट ऑफ द 100 सॉन्ग्स अरमान सॉन्ग 50 फॉर मी No one could have sung them better. Otherwise, it would have been with someone else. When there's a song he can't sing, he never gets it. He has to also earn a song. And this is something our father has taught us: that कुछ नहीं मिलना लासन. I'm not going to call anyone and tell you please listen to my son. Everyone from Mahesh Bhatt to Bhushan Kumar to everyone, we have ourselves gone, stood, waited seven, eight hours that one time that CD is sung. So this journey is like this. and for me my father and his father my grandfather for me i feel i'm a direct soul descendant of sardar malik you know so i have the 60s music in me and the sound of 2022 so i'm just keep like every year i'm just going to you know make music for these legends and that's when i made mehr ho ya na ro so bahut kuch mere life mein ek emotional storm bachpan mein tha and mera har ek gana is like a tribute to my father and my grandfather that's it so lovely amal uh, when this of course coming to the epic suraj dubai because that why i say epic I'm because that i'm tired of it because everyone no. still says ek aur suraj dubai bana do nahi i'm not coming to that <laughs> there was this entire phase where we saw you a good phase all the songs which you were doing making they were making the right noises we yeah. from suraj to bahe to soch na sake to chill getting yeah. your first film fair yeah. for the same you saw success after a long period of struggle did it go to your head no it never did i think but why how what was the one factor that kept you grounded mummy <laughs> love mother like people say that parents keep us grounded my mother keeps both of us underground एनी वो अभी भी शिविल शॉर्ट एंड से उठो प्लेट रखो रखो बर्तन रखो साफ करो ये शी इज लाइक दैट एंड आई थिंक हर शी इज आई टेल दिस इन एवरी इंटरव्यू एंड इज द ट्रूथ दैट शी इज द झांसी की रानी ऑफ दिस फैमिली विद टू स्वॉर्ड इन हैंड्स विच इज अमल एंड अरमान एंड शी हैज केप्ट अस वेरी ग्राउंडेड एनी नथिंग नो ग्रेट फेलियर कैन अफेक्ट अस इट ऑब्वियसली एज अन बींग यू फील लिटिल बैड इफ अ सॉन्ग डज इन वर्क or a film that you've done maybe if it had done better maybe the music would have been would have done better. you know hota hai aisa this industry mein ki kabhi kabhi film nahi chalti aur music bahut acha hai jaise roy lot of people still don't know suraj dubai from, from roy, roy. They just know are wo suraj dubai wali picture ya main hu hero tera wow. film ka naam hero hai but wo film ko gaane se tha bahut time tak so literally 80% of my career has had super duper flop films and all my music from that has been successful it's only when films like dhoni गोलमाल बद्रीनाथ एयरलिफ्ट कपूर एंड सन्स हैपन दैट इवन द फिल्म स्टार्ट डूइंग वेल बट आई हैव बीन अ रिवर्स सक्सेस लाइक जब मेरी फिल्म फ्लॉप हो रही है मेरे गाने सुपर हिट हो रहे आई डोंट प्रे फॉर इट आई होप सब हिट हो बट दैट्स हाउ इट इज आई थिंक यू शुड नॉट टेक एनी थिंग टू हेड बिकॉज वी हैव सीन सच टेरेबल टाइम्स ऑल्सो एज अ फैमिली एंड वी वॉल स्टॉक टू गेदर फॉर एज दो वैल्यूज मैटर की ज्यादा यू नो डोंट फ्लाई अबाउट इट Yeah, but you should be overconfident. I say this because the world is trying to pull you down. So when they pull me down from overconfidence, I'll reach confidence. 
सो इट्स ओके थोड़ा ओवर कॉन्फिडेंट होना जरूरी है अदरवाइज एवरी वन जस्ट योर टू जस्ट मेक यू फील लाइक व्हाटएवर व्हाटएवर मैं एवरी डे लाइक बिफोर आई इवन गो टू दिस एक्चुअली बिकॉज आई रिमेंबर व्हेन लेविटेटिंग दुआ लेपा हट इट वाज टॉक ऑफ द टाउन लाइक ओ ही मेड इट लाइक आई रिमेंबर रीडिंग इट समवेयर ओ ही मेड इट एंड ही इज लाइक गोइंग ऑल अक्रॉस सेवन सीज एज वी से एंड डूइंग द म्यूजिक वाज दैट वन ऑफ द हाइलाइट्स आई शुड से ऑफ योर करियर or it was another stepping stone to success i think uh, everyone you know when duali pa arrived with her own music also in the whole of india has been her fan and for me you know i think as an artist i really respect the kind of lyrics and she speaks about the girl power exactly. and how she stands for herself and you know women as a whole thing i love her music and her vibe but i never thought you know that this is going to happen or like we're going to cross paths someone from her team is going to reach out and we're going to do all these things so i had not thought ki mere ko abhi global jana hai but maybe life has plans always so it came as an opportunity and uh, i did an indian version of it because india may be you know now we are such a big industry and we are such a big population that people are looking at this country as a place ki yahan bhi music chalna zaruri hai yahan pe bhi our films need to reach and india is a musical nation by default if i have to say so i just gave it an indian twist and a uk bhangra hip hop vibe to her original and uh, the label her all of them responded on a very crazy positive way yani i thought they'll make me work hard on seven eight demos i sent one That's and it got locked and they loved it because i brought india to it and later let us really nice to know that someone who's uh, you know doing so well for herself and for women in the world of music that you know she also said she knows shahrukh khan and she knows amal malik that that was my victory i would say for me i'm the biggest fan of uh, shahrukh sir and for me to be just named by anyone not just dua lipa in the same breath that only means a lot so the collaboration obviously opens gates for many other composers you know if i'm doing it if i can do it all of them can so we all should be proud of it and i'm glad that you know it happened in such a cool way i'm all sometimes it is gay you that uh, at 30 when i'm talking to one of the most successful youngest composers i won't i won't call you a composer i'm 31 be, now 31 and i'm turning 32 too it's okay but i should be calling as an all rounder because there are so many facets to your music persona does it like does it scare you that it has come to me at this age i'm i might not be having anything more to give later or as i have heard from many people ki dar lagta hai next kya kare ya next ko live up kaise kare ye live up ka to problem hone wala hai sabko when you do good work if you do songs like roke na roke kaun tujhe main rahu bol do na zara i don't know what all has happened jab tak then expectations logo ke bhi badhte hain and you also get a little you know stressed ki you know now what बट आई थिंक म्यूजिक और मेरा साथ है आई फील देर मोर ट्वेंटी ईयर्स ऑफ म्यूजिक इन मी एंड आई हैव नॉट इवन पुट माई रियल म्यूजिक आउट देर दिस इज मी जस्ट अडेप्टिंग एंड डूइंग माई हार्ट म्यूजिक ऑब्वियसली रिमेनिंग इन टू डे साउंड स्केप एंड काफी चीजें बट जो मैंने सिक्सटीन के एंड ट्वेंटी फोर की एज में जो म्यूजिक बनाया वेन दैट विल कम आउट एंड पीपल विल नो लाइक हाउ तेरे मेरे मोज सॉन्ग आई मेड एट नाइनटीन ले जा मुझे साथ तेरे इट केम एट ट्वेंटी एट There was a song "Salamat" from Sarabjit, okay. which I made at 17, and I'd played to Mahesh Bhatt sir. The lyrics were different. It was "Jab se tu mila mujhe mili jine ki waja, jab se tu mila mujhe hai mil gaya khuda." ऐसे कुछ मैं लिखते रहता था. So a lot of my music, you know, out of my hundred songs, also there are only four or five which has come from. the real unadulterated me you know But i have learned sharing. yeah so okay. abhi now yeah. i have my own label so i'm going to keep doing it baki films ka journey dheere dheere aata hai you know i'm also looking to do after 100 songs i want to do good films i've been a label favorite every label has worked with me they have given them really good music it's been monetarily and visibly successful for them and now i'm happy you know when an amol gupte works with me or you know sometimes even raju hirani sir or somebody i meet they have love for my music even if they don't work with me it's fine but, but there is a nice. certain appreciation from certain people which is enough for the composer me ki chalo i have this is my biggest award so i and actually like even if it sounds boastful i don't know people believe that but i've always been like this you know some people think success ho gaya to pagal ho gaya ऐसा वह है मैं लोगों को 
बट मैं हमेशा से ऐसे रहा क्योंकि कोई ऑप्शन ही नहीं था लाइफ में नहीं किया तो मैं बहुत अलग चलता हूँ मैं स्क्रैच पे भी बहुत मुश्किल से बोला था मेरे स्क्रैच सॉन्ग्स भी ऑब्वियसली आई एन हाउस सुपर स्टार अरमान बट ही इज माई only in, inside home singer i don't call 10 singers and make them sing so i'm very careful about people's emotions ki kisi ko gaane se hat bhi jati hai and kya i personally call and say you know it's not happened someone else is being tried this thing is not there on, in our industry people are very disrespectful about these things you know kisi people any one sings a song or writes a song ka dil jud jata hai the whole kabir singh album also i would say that i had already done five songs for the album before i was replaced but i didn't those songs were supposed to be written by another writer but i had made those melodies on different writers ke likhe hue meters if i had made the tune first i would give those tunes but i made the melody on someone's lyrics so i left the film but it's okay but that's what happens i still had one song ai yeah, na i still have that film fair so i did write by my writers i do write by everyone ye mere papa ne sikha main aise hi chalta hu and it's okay if you win some you lose some all okay and a lot of people have these questions also you know ki people previous to us like pritam da or anu malik and everyone has seen 20 years of glory in 8 years do you think you're depleted you know like iske baad kuch hua nahi to i'm like okay at least in those 100 songs maybe itna hi tha i to believe ki shayad itna hi hoga but musically mere mein itna hai samandar of emotions hai jo main apne tarike se launga i'm not in a rush now to make this 100 into 1000 1000 ठीक है मैं यानी आई हैव सीन व्हेन आई रीच 30 आई वाज लाइक हेडेड लाइफ गोल इज लाइक 23 से 30 कब हुआ सो आई वांट टू चिल एंड डू म्यूजिक एंड आई एम नॉट अफ्रेड ऑफ एनीवन एनी कंपटीशन और एनीथिंग आई विश एवरीवन वेल मैं नए नए आर्टिस्ट या मेरे कंटेम्प्रेरीज के भी गाने खुद ही शेयर कर देता अगर अच्छे हैं यानी मैं अपने फैंस को भी बोलता हूं मेरे अलावा अच्छे ओरिजिनल म्यूजिक को सुनो कोई अच्छा आर्टिस्ट लगता है सेंड मी आई विल शेयर अ सॉन्ग अ सॉन्ग एग्जैक्टली सो ऐसा मैं हूं ऐसा एक्सपेक्ट मैं नहीं करता आई डोंट नीड एनी वन टू शेयर माय म्यूजिक और एनी थिंग आई एम नॉट सेइंग दैट बट एवरीवन शुड सपोर्ट लाइक दिस इज वन थिंग व्हिच इज लेस योर पीपल डोंट सपोर्ट ईच अदर पीपल डोंट सपोर्ट न्यू टैलेंट दैट्स व्हाई आल्सो आई ओपन द लेबल व्हिच इज बाय द आर्टिस्ट फॉर द आर्टिस्ट एनी वन हैज अ गुड मेलोडी गुड लिरिक्स कम टू अस एंड इवन इफ यू डोंट वांट टू वर्क विद आवर लेबल पुट इट आउट देयर बिकॉज़ आई विल शेयर इट सो आई वांट टू बी दैट आई एम नॉट इंटरेस्टेड इन कंपीटिंग एंड यानी लोग ये पूछते कि हर दिन एक सिंगर बन जाता यानी देर आर फाइव लैक सिंगर्स देर आर फाइव थाउजेंड फिफ्टी थाउजेंड कम्पोजर्स हाउ विल यू सर्वाइव आई केम टू रूल आई नेवर केम टू सर्वाइव Does it come also with some pressure points? कुछ एक एक pressure point या एक एक ऐसे barometer के साथ भी आता है because while you are also super successful in yeah. your sphere, so is Arman. I mean, कैसे balance out करते हो? हम लोग अभी सोचते नहीं इतना. हम लोग दोनों यानी अभी भी भी fight like cats and dogs. यानी हम लोग के recording sessions का actual BTS को देख ले तो डर जाए. निकाली कब तो label है ना? नहीं 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 � मैं जाकर उसको पकड़ रहा ऐसे हिला रहा हूँ ऐसे गा क्या कर रहा है एंड लाइक वी कॉलिंग माय मॉम मैं नहीं काम कर सकता पागल कंपोजर है ये यू नो सो दोस थिंग्स हैपन आई थिंक वी फॉरगेट हु वी आर ऑलवेज व्हेन वी कम टू डू अ सॉन्ग दैट्स व्हाई माय इमोशन माय जर्नी एवरीथिंग दैट यंग किड हैज सीन एंड ही हैज बीन पार्ट ऑफ रिकॉर्डिंग्स वेयर सीनियर सिंगर्स अरिजीत सोनू निगम एवरीवन हैज बीन दैट किड हैज सीन द जर्नी ऑफ मी एज अ कंपोजर इज असिस्टेड मी ही इज लर्नड विद मी and no one knows my emotion better than my brother like the way he delivers a song for me when he sings it exactly then it ladai hoti hai but when he sings you can see that he is singing my heart so i think arman at his age you know he is almost a decade younger than so many singers and he is the first kid from india to be on times square i was superstar in my family we have nothing else but to be proud of him and बहुत मुश्किल है यानी वो ज्यादा समझदार है मुझसे आई थिंक समटाइम्स ही इज द एल्डर ब्रदर एंड आई एम 17 अगेन वी हैव दैट डिफरेंस ही इज वेरी मैच्योर एंड बिकॉज़ ही इज बीन ऑन टेलीविजन उसके ऊपर देयर हैज बीन लॉट ऑफ लाइमलाइट सिंस चाइल्डहुड बट ही इज मैनेज्ड इट वेल 
एंड फॉर अस यानी डैड ने पहले ही बोला था कि मेरे को नहीं चाहिए तुम लोग दोनों डुओ बनो यानी यू कैन बी अ सिंगल कंपोजर डुओ बट डोंट बिकम कंपोजर्स टुगेदर इट्स लाइक बिकॉज तुम लोग बहुत अलग सोचते हो एंड आई हैव सीन टीम्स ब्रेक एंड फैमिलीज ब्रेक एंड ही नेवर वांटेड दैट सो वी बोथ आल्सो वर वेरी श्योर कि डैड आल्सो वांट्स प्लस मैं जो बोलता उसके 10 पॉइंट अलग अरमान बोलता वो कुछ बोलता आई हैव डिफरेंट ओपिनियंस बट समवेयर दैट सिनर्जी ओनली इज व्हाट मेक्स म्यूजिक लाइक व्हाट वी हैव 50 सॉन्ग्स टुगेदर and everyone everyone loves music. every song of ours together so it's it's a blessed team it's you can't when this these two come together the whole internet the whole country it's like a festival it's like a celebration when two brothers come together i have a personal question when no you get problem. up in the morning when do i get up in no, the morning no when you get up in the morning what's the what's the thing which वो कौन सा इंस्पिरेशन नोट हेट होता है कि टुडे आई हैव टू क्रिएट दिस ट्यून और वॉट सर वन थिंग विच कीप्स यू इन सिंक विद म्यूजिक आज भी बिकॉज हम यही बात करें कि इतना इतना शोर है अगर आस पास वो म्यूजिक कहाँ से निकालते हैं हम डेली मेरा फोन तो मैं उठाता ही नहीं हूँ पहले तो शोर कैंसिल हो चुका है एंड मैं जो जो समझे दुनिया में वो उनका प्रॉब्लम जो मुझे जानते हो जानते कि गाना बना रहा होगा या सो रहा होगा बिकॉज फॉर मी even in my sleep i see notations i see you know it's very difficult so i have to try six times in the day jisme do baar neend sahi aati hai but one thing i had learned bhat saab had told me something like he's like people come to your house to work every day to clean the house or whatever staff your hmm. everyone is like every day one sana ke wohi cheez karta he like don't rest others you'll rust he told me this he's like keep trying he's like ghatiya gana bhi bane aapse but try one tune a day at least not that you can make 10 If you can, great. Sometimes there are those days when I can make three, four good songs, but there are days I make really bullshit music also. So, कर करते रहो, you know, keep trying. That is important. It's so like a up. practice. Yeah, you have to wake up, and I just wake up and come right here to this piano and try. And in ten minutes, I know, नहीं अभी नहीं बन रहा, and I leave it. So music is like that. You can spend half an hour, one hour, and in that energy of one hour, if you're making something, keep flowing. But अगर if it doesn't happen, give it time. क्योंकि कोई कभी कभी पांच मिनट में अच्छे गाने बनते हैं कभी पांच महीने कभी पांच साल लोग बोलते हैं कि एक ट्यून कभी ऐसे ही आती है हाँ और जो ऐसे आती है यूजुअली हमेशा वाली होती है यू नो समटाइम्स टफ दैट कम्स इन फाइव मिनट्स रिमेन्स फॉर एवर एंड समटाइम्स यू वर्क ऑन सम फाइव मंथ्स एन लाइक वॉट आई मेड सो देर आर देर आर दोज मोमेंट्स ऑल्सो बट वट कीप्स मी इन सिंक विथ म्यूजिक इज आउट गो बैक टू सूरज डू बाय बिकॉज आई प्रोमिस्ड माई सेल्फ टिल देन आई वॉज ऑलवेज फीलिंग की मैं म्यूजिक को चुन रहा हूँ बचपन से सीख रहा हूँ मेरे को सब आता है यानी सब पूरा नहीं पड़ा है नो माई म्यूजिक म्यूजिक मेरे को कब चुनेगा वो नहीं आया था कभी भी एंड वेन दैट सॉन्ग डिड वेल आई प्रोमिस्ड माई सेल्फ एंड एवरी ऑन अराउंड मी कि अब मैं छोड़ो नहीं ना एवरी सॉन्ग विल बी ट्रीटेड लाइक इट्स माई फर्स्ट एंड लास्ट सो मैं हर गाने में वैसा डेडिकेशन करता हूँ हेल्थ खराब हो जाती है उसमें आई डोंट वॉन्ट एवरी ऑन टू फॉलो मी ऑन दैट रूट बट वेकअप एंड गिव योर बेस्ट आई थिंक एंड यू हैव टू बिलीव दैट आई आई नो I am an I am a true, honest, emotional composer, and no one can understand another human's heart better than you. You have to believe that. Then only you can make such music. Amar also when we make music, global language hai, sab ke liye for Jee. anyone and everyone. Attachment, detachment ka concept kaise relate karte hain? Apne hi music se kyunki agar kisi aur ko aapke gaane se itna pyar ho sakta hai, to aapko to bahot hoga. Attachment har ek cheez ke liye healthy hai, but ek point ka it gets unhealthy. It gets unhealthy. I literally when the song comes on any it's released or it's on the radio, I hear it once just to check की mix सही था कि नहीं. After that I never like to hear it. जब मेरे radio पे गाना बजता है, it's like ये बंद करो क्योंकि नया tune नहीं बनने वाला है अगर यही सुनते रहे. क्योंकि somewhat my music is simply commercial as people say. कि I don't try to be make commercial music. It happens. And I write. with my writers we try to write a very great big thought in a simple way that you know young people also get it and seniors also listen and say ki halki poetry nahi ki to bachcho se le boodho tak sabko ek value in sound or lyrics of music production or tune they'll get it in my song so once i have achieved the four pillars i say for me ki tune achhi hai lyrics acha hai gaya sahi hai and production music production live instruments so i still do live a lot I have not left that. Like I have violins, violas, everything. You know, guitars. Tak live now. You can do it on a keyboard, but I don't do that because that is the sound I want to also keep alive. So, ये सब चार चीजें जब मेरे को लगता हाँ ये सही है. These four takes are fine. Then I just let go. I said now we have something. Now don't overthink. And every song has its own destiny. हर गाने का नसीब है. वो चलना होगा, चलेगा. 
कौन सी फिल्म से ये भी नहीं फर्क पड़ता नहीं चलना होगा नहीं चलेगा सो डोंट ग्रो टू क्रेजी एन की हाउ डू आई रिलीज हाउ डू आई डू दिस डिड आई मेस दिस अप सबको होते हैं प्रॉब्लम्स मुझे भी होते हैं बट आफ्टर अ पॉइंट लर्न टू लेट गो एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू बी मेकिंग न्यू म्यूजिक स्टॉप लिस्टिंग टू योर ओल्ड म्यूजिक इवन इफ योर फ्रेंड्स प्ले दम बैक टू यू वेन यू आज एक सक्सेसफुल मुकाम पे खड़े हो अरमान इक्वली सक्सेसफुल है पापा क्या कहते हैं आप वेन ही लुक्स आट यू बिकॉज वेन वी स्टार्टेड दिस इंटरव्यू It started for your first word was your how your father and your mother both held your hand and today yeah. you completely get them to get it. How your parents evaluate this success for you? Because it it मेरा जितना इस पूरे इंटरव्यू में एक न चोर है कि आपके पेरेंट्स आपके लिए और उनका वैलिडेशन इफ डेट इज़ ज़रूरत वही सब है वही सब है. Audience भी है but parents सबसे पहले मेरी मम्मी को तो बिल्कुल half baked products पसंद नहीं है scratch सुना तो तो चिल्ला देती है. बोलते फाइनल सुनाओ चलो ये सब टाइम वेस्ट मत करो मेरा सो शी इज वेरी परफेक्ट हो जाएगा तब सुनाना डैड इज इन्वॉल्व ऑन एवरी स्टेप एट एवरी स्टेप ही लिसन ही गाइड्स ही इज अ ग्रेट म्यूजिशियन हु डेंट गेट इज ड्यू एंड सॉरी इफ इज गेटिंग इमोशनल बट नाउ फ्रॉम देयर आई हैव ऑलरेडी स्पोकन द स्ट्रगल्स एंड एवरीथिंग इज सीन फॉर दैट मैन ही इज गॉन बैक टू लिविंग हिज टीनएज लाइफ आई फील आई थिंक बोथ ऑफ देम आर लिविंग लाइक अ 16 ईयर ओल्ड कपल इन लव दे ट्रैवलिंग द वर्ल्ड दे गेट टू सी things and places they have never seen with arman cuz he's touring the world okay. he was at wembley and so many places you know both of us took important roles i was the back end handling songs creating the music that he went and put out in the world, world. so both the brothers you know for them they are very happy that dono successful sath mein kabhi kabhi ek reh jata hai ya dono sath mein kabhi successful it is very difficult for the house and its environment hum log dono ne father hai. saw that yeah First completely time. saw yani lived it he's he's kept a smile like and i have said this like i was uh, 14 years old when i've seen him lose projects and every time he lost a project he would come home with a cake so every time he came home with a cake i knew ki aaj wo film shoot gaya ye show reh gaya but he would celebrate his losses till now i cannot be like him you know i'd be like mujhe nahi milna aaj kisi se main so raha hu mera mood kharab hai you know that but that man has smiled through it all kuch kharab ho gaya then we don't have money for the next installment but he's like mummy ka birthday mood kharab hai unka new zealand chalo matlab new zealand my masi would stay there but still the take it. like it was impossible to interject kyunki i had never in my whatever readings i done for your interview i saw dabu ji even speaking about anu malik success or you know making with it respect. A, with respect yeah, yeah, yeah. he never put it out ki mujhe se गुरेज है मुझे से कोई मलाल है आई थिंक आई थिंक देर कैन बी नो अदर इज एन एंजल बहुत मुश्किल है ऐसा आदमी बनना और ऐसा रहने से इंडस्ट्री में बहुत लोग एडवांटेज उठाते हैं यू नो मैं मैं भी इनोसेंट हूँ सब कुछ हूँ बट माय मॉम्स एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ व्हाट हैपन टू द फादर सेव डज की डोंट लेट पीपल टेक एडवांटेज यानी तो हम लोग थोड़े से वो बच गए क्योंकि मम्मी को शी को I'm telling you this used to they used to wait uh, next to Centaur Hotel or somewhere at a bus stop and both used to see we used to see people go by in their big cars and live their dreams and we as a couple at 20s and 30s and 40s went by and we like हम लोग का यानी यही bus stop पे हम हैं पर कभी बस हमारे लिए नहीं आती and my mom used to say कि मैं उस दिन I'll be happy you know when without you know लोग लोग बोलना पड़ता है लोगों को कभी कभी music बजाने अपना सब you know there are you have to say अरे वो गाना बजाओ She's like I once, you know, she used to. She's wanted so much for her husband, and so much didn't happen. But she stood by him. He stood by her, and she was like, "Amar, I'll be the happiest the day, you know, when I'm sitting somewhere and your songs are playing." And then she called me once from some friend's party, and she's like, "Idhar thak gaya, bolke ki mat bajao, bolke gaane." She's like, "Bita, twelve are playing of yours." I was like, "Ma, khush. I'm here. I'm going to do another song. Chalo, be happy." So I think for my dad, even when I was nominated for film fair, I was like obviously excited that it's a huge honor. And but me like, अभी जीतना awards ये वो सब सब was for Dabu Malik. There is nothing that I wanted to do musically for anyone except my father and grandfather. वो nomination पे इतने खुश हो गए tender coconut का पूरा family था कि उन्होंने खुद खाया है. तो मैं बोल रहा हूँ पागल हो गए कुछ हो जाएगा आपको. ऐसा जीते नहीं है अभी क्या कर रहे हो थोड़ा लिविंग लाइक टुडे ही हैज़ ऑल द बेस्ट 
but it's unbelievable i remember sonu nigam sir told me at some award function that you know maine dabbu ki itni struggle dekhi hai ki you know and even jaspinder narula ji you know on sare gaon par she said ki wo jab he used to feel low he used to people were there for him but they couldn't completely be there for him because it's a very difficult it's a industry very difficult industry it's like dono bachcho ke through sooch samet both the parents dreams have reached so mainly yahi tha ki before they leave this world i can do one thing at least just say they're proud today i think they're proud of everything except the fact ki main sota nahi hu time pe <laughs> but i think my parents dreams are almost like everything that they wanted in their life arman and i have done it that's that's really wow lastly uh, amal if we close this all the young singers jitne bhi log bahar baithe hain jo aapko sun rahe hain jo aaj shayad Uh, I even I was not aware of. Thank you first of all for opening up. क्योंकि इतना डिटेल में कोई अपनी लाइफ क्या आपको दरवाजा खोल के नहीं दिखाता मैं तो दिखाता हूँ मेरी पूरी जिंदगी ताकि नए लोग जाने कि उन बच्चों के लिए जो इस एक एक thought process से आते हैं what is the best idea which they can maybe take because I think हम हर किसी से कुछ ना कुछ सीख सकते हैं अगर आप अगर कोई आज पूछता है हमारा आपकी जिंदगी से मैं क्या ले सकता हूँ I think मेरी जिंदगी से सबसe and in today i would say the lesson is that i always took inspiration from other people's journeys also yani khud ki journey mushkil rahi hai but mujhse bhi mushkil logo ki bhi journeys rahi hai and i would say you know some, a very good singer and composer ankit tiwari of course when he arrived you know aapko ye janna pade ki is industry mein one who had a full slate of super hit previous music in his family one has a clean slate both made it The only thing common between two people, like he's come from Kanpur, struggled. I was from Bombay, so I knew offices, guys, सब कुछ पर मेरे struggles और अलग थे उसके अलग थे दोनों ने अपनी जगह बने तो you know you cannot give reason as an artist आर्टिस्ट की ना इधर सिर्फ नाम होता है या सिर्फ नए को ही मिलता है जिसका बैगेज नहीं है इधर बैगेज बहुत था उधर बैगेज नहीं था पर उनकी भी अपनी बैगेज थी तो फॉर न्यू राइटर्स सॉन्ग राइटर्स कंपोजर्स इफ सम वन कैन वर्क हार्ड लाइक दैट and come to bombay i saw his journey when he did ashiki i was like ye jisne kiya hai wow that like, time nobody that, could beat that yeah, the and time even then do immortal gaane to hey tu hai ki nahi also with me in roy hmm. when we did i was like i have literally seen journeys of people i've seen even pritam das journey salim suleman i've seen them work for my uncle no one's had it easy तो आप ये मत सोचो कि यानी कॉन्टैक्ट होगा तो हो जाएगा hmm. या कॉन्टैक्ट नहीं है तो नहीं होगा दोनों का हो सकता है अगर दैट फायर इज इन साइड यू एंड मेरा एक गाना है बेसब्रिया विच आई बिलीव इज माइन एंड एवरी वन जोनी कि कदमों पे तेरे बादल झुकेंगे जब तक तुझे ये एहसास है जागीर तेरी तेरा खजाना ये तिश्ने की ये प्यास है डोंट फर्गेट दैट फायर डोंट लीव दैट डोंट लीव योर सोल बिहाइंड कीप योर सोल अहेड feel the pain feel the happiness enjoy the success sleep over the failures or have pizza in bed deal with everything because usi se ek acha artist bano if you stop feeling your music will suffer feel the good bad ugly everything and don't give up yani aasan hai bolna aapko lag raha hoga ki ab main ek position mein ho to bol raha hu exactly but maine tabhi bhi nahi give up kiya jab mere ko 12 12 composers ne mere ko chance nahi diya या स्टूडियो से मुझे लोगों ने बाहर निकाला है वही ऑफिस जहां मैं सीडी देता था आज मेरे सीडी सुन रहे हैं तो इट ऑल कम्स बैक यू हैव टू नॉट गिव अप यानी आई स्टार्टेड माय ड्रीम एज बीइंग अ कंपोजर 16 आई गॉट अ 23 सो सेवन इयर्स वो भी थे तो यू हैव टू फाइट योर डीमेंस पहले फाइट योर डीमेंस द वर्ल्ड इज ईजी टू फाइट लवली Thank you so much, Jamal. I I had no idea. I when I started, I was like, there will be journey, there will be discussions. But you just completely took me on a different path. Thank you. But thank you. No, but this is one of my most wonderful interviews. Thank I you so much. It. And it also, I always say that the person has to open up. You have to have yeah. the courage to open up your heart because yes. it's easier said than done. I might could have asked you anything, and you would have not answered. But <laughs> no, I'm so unfortunately much. everyone thinks I answer too much. <laughs> but I love no. to say speak from my heart. and i know now we are done with the interview i can say that people end up also taking so many political conjectures of almost whatever we say so yeah kuch to log kahenge aur logon ka kaam hai kya na chodo bekar ki baatein gana banate rehna thank you
शायद दिल को खबर थी नहीं गुजरा समा याद आएगा तुझसे जुदा होते अपना सफर रुक जाएगा आंखों में कोई ख्वाब है नहीं फिर क्यों रात भर जागता हूं मैं क्यों तुझे चाहता हूं मैं तुझे चाहता हूं क्यों जब हम जुदा हो चुके हैं फिर भी जाने क्यों तुझे चाहता हूं मैं तुझे चाहता हूं क्यों दूर है नजर से तू फिर भी दिल के पास है खुश है तेरी यादों में हम कहा उदास है दुनिया की बातों से क्या फर्क पड़ता है दिल जानता है तू हर कदम पे साथ है साथ है नहीं माना आज हम कुछ बदला नहीं ये मानता हूं मैं है मतलब तेरी यारी से क्या लेना दुनियादारी से तू बन मेरी है मैं बनू तेरा रंजना लबो पे नाम है तेरा हाँ दिल में याद है तेरी तू मेरा ना हुआ तो क्या तू फिर भी जान है मेरी सुन मेरे खुदा बस इतनी सी मेरी दुआ लौटा दे हम सफर मेरा जाएगा कुछ नहीं तेरा तेरे ही दर पे हूँ खड़ा जाऊं तो जाऊं मैं कहा तकदीर को बदल मेरी मुझ पे होगा करम तेरा तेन इतना मैं प्यार करा एक पल बिच सौगा करा तू जावे मैनू छत दा कि मैं तो तेरे रंग में रंग चुका हूं बस तेरा बन चुका हूं मेरा मुझ में कुछ नहीं सब तेरा मैं तो तेरे रंग में रंग चुका हूं बस तेरा बन चुका हूं मेरा मुझ में कुछ नहीं सब तेरा ये लम्हा जो ठहरा है मेरा है ये तेरा है ये लम्हा मैं जी लू जरा तुझ में खो या रहू मैं मुझ में खो ही रहे तो खुद को ढूंढ लेंगे फिर कभी है तुझसे मिलता रहू मुझसे मिलती रहे तो खुद से हम मिलेंगे फिर कभी हाँ फिर कभी ओ हाँ हाँ फिर कभी हाँ फिर कभी Hi everyone this is Amal Malik and you are watching me on the Story Web